Hello Board Game Brothers and Sisters, I'm Adam Singer and welcome to another episode where I'll let you know of all the board games launching on Kickstarter and GameFound over the next week. If you're new to the channel, we do this every week going over all the upcoming campaigns, but just like last week, this one is going to be a really slow week with just one game I have to go over. But if you do want to see more games that are coming up, definitely subscribe because there will be a lot more in January because things pick up really, really quickly. And if you do want to get more information on the board games that are coming up, definitely feel free to check out the Discord in the description below because we list all the games that we know about so far going into the next month or into the next year and we have all the links that we have available on there so you can go ahead and select any of those games and look into them a little bit more for yourself. We also do occasionally run giveaways over there and you can sign up for notifications if you want to get notified of anything new that I add to the discord so that's really the best way on the internet to stay up to date with all the upcoming board games but with all that out of the way I don't really have much else to say so I guess we can just get into the game that's launching this week. And the first and only campaign that we have launching this week is launching on December 9th, and this one's called Enemy at the Gates. And this one is a cooperative tower defense card game that plays one to four players. And in this game, players are going to be taking on the roles of different wizards with asymmetrical abilities. And you're going to be taking turns drawing spells from a shared deck and then using your spells and abilities to fight back against hordes of enemies. Resource management is important in this game because you're going to be spending mana in order to cast those spells and to use your special abilities. And each turn there's going to be new waves of enemies spawning. These enemies can have varying abilities but they can also have different strength, speed, and defense which is going to make dealing with each one just a little bit different. And the spells that you will be casting can deal damage but they can also have some other effects like slowing down the enemies or making them vulnerable. And the spells can even have area effects that affect any of the enemies that pass through that area. And if the players are able to defeat the entire horde of enemies, players are going to go up against that final warlord and if you're able to kill that warlord then you win the game and that's everything i have for you this week like i said it's a really short week but if you want to see more of the games to come definitely go ahead and check out the discord in the description below and feel free to subscribe if you want to be notified of future videos like this where i'll be going over a lot more games and as always thanks so much for watching i truly do appreciate you checking out these videos even when there isn't a whole lot to report on but i hope you have a fantastic holiday whatever you have planned for the next couple weeks here and until next time keep that shelf cluttered and the table full. Oh.